show you uh, how to rig an ICOM terminal mode up with uh, Pi style. In here we've got a Raspberry uh, Pi from Amazon uh, which has just arrived. So I'll unbox this and put this together and then once we get this together uh, we'll rig an ICOM terminal mode up. Right, as you can see, I've got a black enclosure. Uh, and we've got another enclosure. I don't know if this is white. I think I ordered white, but it might be black. I don't know until I open that up. That's the power supply. There's the Raspberry Pi. There's a few heat sinks. Right, here's the Raspberry Pi. I'll try to touch it around the edge. What I'm going to do, I'm going to put some of these uh, heat sinks on. See, so I put the heat shields on. One on the back, on there. There, ba -ba. and two there. Right, as you can see, if I take that out there, you do screw this down. So, you put that on there, like so. Oh. And then you screw it down into that so I'll screw it down. So I'll screw down now, got the four screws in and uh, right now that goes like that install the fan which we need to connect now onto the pins there so the fan is now installed, that's just about put together, which is quite nice. Quite good is that. So we're not using this case today, because I bought this one, because it has fans and heat sinks and everything. Right, we've now got the lead plugged into the back of the icon radio. So what we need to do now is we need to plug that into the power start, like so. And then we'll plug Ethernet in, even though this has got built-in Wi-Fi. It's got built-in Wi-Fi, but we're going to plug Ethernet in. And now power. And that now is running, because I can feel the fan going. So once that comes on, which takes it a few minutes, we'll go into the program and I'll show you how to set it all up. Right, once you've got your PyStar all up and running, you need to go into a web browser and just put in PyStar forward slash and then enter and then you'll get a screen like this but yours will say it needs a modem and everything setting up but i've already set mine up so just uh, there's plenty of information online how to how to set this up if you've never used it before then what you do once you've got all set up you, and it's all up and running properly you go into configuration you must click d star repeater which is there it will come clicked in that so you must make sure you're on D star repeater that is simplex mode I the the host name is always pi star unless you've got one or two and now I've got two running so I've got I put a slash two so we don't clash with each other you put your call sign into there doesn't matter what frequencies are there because you're not using RF this is just your locator which you can fill in yourself and then you go to radio model type and you must make sure it says icon radio in terminal mode d star repeater only because that's what it has to say uh, normally if you're running it as a hotspot you'd be there you'd have that one in but why not we're using it like a, as a terminal mode that's just for your aprs and here is where you can change rooms. I'll just give you an example. So we'll press C and we're going to go 
to reflect to sex. For those who are, I will get this right in a minute. They're going to go to reflect to sex. And there's a lot of rooms there. They're going to go to reflect to sex. Right, once you've got everything up and running, what you need to do, once you've got all your programming done, what you need to do, you need to go into menu and go down till you find DV Gateway, which is there in the menu. So you just go down till you find DV Gateway, click on that, and then press on Terminal Mode. And there you are, you're all uh, up and ready to go. And it'll say there Terminal Mode. I'm very uh, pain, pain in your way. Back in the two minutes, please, lad. I'm going to be busy. Is that okay, Anthony? No problem. You there, Chris, yet? Uh, have you seen it all? Are you still offline? There you are. As you can see, it's all running perfectly. And if you want to change reflectors, we can go over here. Uh, take the link to the reflector. We'll link to reflector one. Link two R E F zero zero one Charlie. So they are all up and running. You can also change rooms in the web browser. You can also change to any room you want in the web browser. Okay, thanks for tuning in. 73.